Welcome to Tesla Global, the home of the latest Tesla news. Today we take a look at the new 2022 Model 3, also the fact that the Model 3 in India is struggling with ground clearance. Without hesitation let's get into the video. Tesla Model 3 Ground Clearance Issue Slow Launch in India Tesla's Model 3 sedan has a ground clearance that is too low for Indian roads, according to a new report. The vehicle's low body design may slow its launch in India, where the sedan has been testing for nearly two months. A report from Autocar India indicates that the Tesla Model 3 has a ground clearance of 115 mm, just 25 mm too low for Indian roads. According to the report, Tesla will have to increase the ride height to at least 140 mm for the Model 3 to be approved for operation on India's roads, meaning the Model Y may launch before the sedan does. Tests of the Model 3 have been going on for almost two months now in India, but the latest trials assess the vehicle's maneuverability over speed bumps. During testing sessions with the Idiata, a Spanish-based engineering company with an office in India, the Model 3 bottomed out on 160 of the 200 speak breakers it attempted to drive over. Engineers have recommended the suspension design be revisited and the ground clearance increased to 165 mm. Tesla vehicles have a lower body style naturally due to their design, which houses the battery pack underneath the car's body. This naturally assists the vehicle in being lower than normal. It is not uncommon for most electric vehicles to have a slightly lower orientation than other vehicles due to this. However, Tesla will likely have to experiment with other suspension options and body modifications to prohibit the undercarriage from scraping against speed bumps or uneven terrain. Tesla's attempt to enter the Indian market has been going on for several years. However, 2021 has seen the most progress as the company gained business licenses early in the year. Additionally, CEO Elon Musk has hinted that the company's entrance into the market is imminent. Still, Tesla has been attempting to reduce the hefty import duties that apply to cars that are manufactured outside of the country. Tesla China Sues Brake Failure Model 3 Protester for Defamation Tesla China is reportedly suing the brake failure protester who climbed on top of a Model 3 display unit during the Shanghai Auto Show back in April. Tesla China is suing the protester, Zhang Yajou, for defamation, according to local sources. The company also demands an apology and retribution of RMB 5 million, tilde dollar 700 comma 000, for damages caused to the brand. After her protest, Zhang claimed that the Model 3 had a faulty braking system. In May, the former Tesla owner filed a defamation lawsuit against Tesla at the Biguan District People's Court in Anyang, Henan Province. She claimed that her family experienced abuse and mental stress because of statements from Tesla China's VP of External Affairs Grace Tao and the company's branches in Beijing and Shanghai. Zhang demanded an apology in RMB 50,000, tilde dollar 7, 000, from Tesla. Zhang's protests sparked a barrage of similar brake failure claims in China by other Tesla owners. Later, Tesla China's legal team cracked down on Tesla owners and even local media outlets who made the brake failure claims for entertainment purposes, or just to join the trend. For instance, one Tesla Model X owner posted a TikTok video that supposedly showed a brake failure incident in his car. Later, the Tesla owner admitted to staging the skit for entertainment purposes only and issued an apology. Tesla is no stranger to claims trying to tarnish its reputation. Back in the United States, Tesla is currently being criticized for its recently released FSD beta button. In addition, the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration NHTSA, launched a formal investigation on autopilot. Most recently, five Texas officers filed a lawsuit against Tesla after a drunk driver crashed his Model X into their vehicles. Since the brake failure protest and numerous claims by Tesla owners of similar incidents, Tesla China has beefed up its legal team. From the string of apologizes, Tesla has received for issuing false claims about the company, the legal team is not going easy on anyone spreading fear, uncertainty, or doubt about the EV car maker. How much does a Tesla cost? Model by model price breakdown in the past decade, Tesla has become an icon in the automotive industry. From the 3 to the X, each excels in its own domain. Just 13 years after the first Roadster deliveries, Tesla has become perhaps the most salient US automaker. Whether it's the compact sedan or crossover segment, it's more than apparent that Tesla is the most popular electric car brand. Instead of simply building electric cars, Tesla built an icon based upon an ecosystem and a lifestyle. In 2021, its ecosystem is stronger than ever. Nevertheless, prepare to meet all Tesla models present and future. 2021 Tesla Model 3 Standard Plus, $39,990. 
The Tesla Model 3 Standard Plus is Tesla's cheapest model as well as the quintessential affordable EV currently for sale. Whether it's the Model 3 Standard Plus's performance, range, or driving dynamics, it has been setting the industry basis for comparison since 2019. The Model 3 Standard Plus can go from 0 to 60 in just 5.3 seconds, and its range is a solid EPA-rated 262 miles, which puts far costlier options to shame. If you want an entry-level Tesla, but are willing to wait until March 2022 for delivery, the Model 3 is an excellent option. Range 262 miles Drivetrain, RWD Acceleration, 0 to 60 in 5.3 seconds 2021 Tesla Model 3 Standard Plus LFP, $39,990 The Tesla Model 3 Standard Plus with the LFP, Lithium Iron Phosphate, battery is the Cloak & Dagger Model 3. What makes the LFP Model 3 mysterious is the fact that it's only available at dealerships or on Tesla's inventory page. Moreover, unlike the regular Model 3 SR Plus, the LFP variant has 9 fewer miles of range, but it can be regularly charged to 100%. Effectively, you'd get more range on a daily basis because Tesla recommends charging to 90% on all other models. If you're interested in a Model 3 and want one soon, the LFP is definitely the best way to go, just make sure to check with your local Tesla center to see if they're in stock. Range 253 miles Drivetrain, RWD Acceleration, 0 to 60 in 5.3 seconds 2021 Tesla Model 3 Long Range, $49,990 The Tesla Model 3 Long Range continues to pack a massive punch in the range and power department, all for a reasonable price. The 2021 Tesla Model 3 Long Range AWD costs less than $50,000 and can provide 353 miles of range, which is an incredible figure. Complementing the range is a rapid 0-60 to 60 time of just 4.2 seconds. For what you get, the Model 3 Long Range is a great option. Range, 353 miles Drivetrain, AWD, Acceleration, 0 to 60 in 4.2 seconds 2021 Tesla Model Y Long Range, $53,990 After fulfilling deliveries in March 2020, the Model Y quickly dominated the electric crossover market. In early 2021, a less expensive standard range variant was released, but it only lasted for a few months. Now, the cheapest Model Y costs $53,990, but it can go 326 miles on a single charge and features a dual-motor setup. While the price is becoming more and more out of reach, so is its delivery date. If you were to order a long-range Y, you'd be sitting at a March 2022 delivery date. Range, 326 miles Drivetrain, AWD, acceleration, 0-60 to 60 in 4.8 seconds. 2021 Tesla Model 3 Performance, $56,990 Reaching its third year in production, the Tesla Model 3 Performance still excites. With a sub $60,000 tag, the Model 3 Performance is one of the overall best performing vehicles for the price. 0-60 to 60 takes just 3.1 seconds, and it can achieve a top speed of 162 miles per hour. As these performance figures are impressive for any car, the Model 3 Performance is a 5-seater sedan with a 315-mile range. Range, 315 miles. Drivetrain, AWD, acceleration, 0 to 60 in 3.1 seconds. Do you think Tesla will outsell rivals in 2022? Let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, then please leave a like, and if you are new to the channel, then why not subscribe? Thanks for watching.